Hello, Hi. welcome to Dr. Campbell's office. Just fill that out and have a seat and he'll be with you shortly. Okay, thanks. So, uh, what are you in for? Excuse me? What brings a girl like you to a place like this? That's a little bit of a personal question, don't you think? I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm not too good at the whole small talk thing. It's all right. Well, maybe you could help me. What? See, I'm, I'm continually trying to improve myself. So whenever I make a mistake or I mess up, I just try to figure out what I could have done. Um, I don't know. I guess you could start with the weather. It's a nice day, that type of thing. Oh, no. It's pretty lame. You got it, Mr. Crow? I'm giving you the old standard doctor's advice. Then don't do that anymore, okay? Mm. Thank you. Um, I will do my best. Thank you for your visit, Mr. Crow. Thank you. See you soon. Of course. The doctor will see you now. Hello there. Hello. Let's hop up on the table there and uh, tell me what's been bothering you. Well, Doc, um, I fear it's the nightmares again. You fear them? Well, yes, but that's not what I was saying. I'm sorry, what were you saying then? I think they're acting up again. And how are they acting? They aren't acting like anything, but I fall asleep, and then next thing I know, I wake up and I'm screaming and crying. Crying and screaming. Well, that won't do. Well, with your permission, I'd like to try something a little unorthodox. That's okay. Anything to stop them. Yes, doctor? Could you send them to the next patient, please? Of course. The doctor will see you now. Please, come in, have a seat. I asked you two to be here because you uh, each face a similar issue. And I thought a little group therapy might be the best way to fix the issue for the both of you. Now, I want you to explain your nightmares to each other. Uh, you start. It all starts when I'm alone in this spooky house. And then I hear groaning coming from the basement. I find the stairs and even though I don't want to, I walk down. Groaning gets louder, and I hear that rattling of chains. And I can tell the sound is coming from behind this old beat up paint peeled door. I open the door. And some hairy, slobbering, rabid, wolf like creature leaps out from my throat. And that's when I wake up screaming. You see, you're not alone in this. And remember, there's safety in numbers. Keep that in mind tonight. And I promise you'll wake up tomorrow in a much brighter way. It all it starts, starts with me alone, alone in this spooky, spooky house. house. Then I hear then the groaning coming from the base base. I find the stairs, and even though I don't want to, I walk down into the dark darkness. Then the groaning gets louder, and I hear that rattling rattle change. change. And I can and tell I can the tell sound is coming from behind this old, old beat-up, beat paint-peeled paint door. door. I open the door. And some, and some hairy, hairy, slobbering, slobbering rabid, rabid wolf-like wolf creature, creature leaps out from my throat. That's, That's when, when I wake up. up. Scream, scream, scream. You see? You're not alone, You're not alone in, this. in this. And remember, there's remember safety, safety in numbers. numbers. Keep that in Keep mind that tonight, tonight. And I promise, I promise you'll wake up tomorrow in a much brighter way. way.